Good morning, everybody. It is yet another car vlog. I hate that half of my vlogs for vlog days have been in the car, but this time of year, especially, this is my life. Um, so we are at the post office now. We're gonna run in, and it actually doesn't look too busy, so we're gonna go in pretty quickly. I have a package to mail out to our angel family. I have a bunch of well, bills and <laughs> um, cards yeah, to send out to you done. guys. Yeah. And um, then we are gonna go, I need to get Trevor some clothes. He's been having issues wearing a certain type of hoodie at school and he wants some different hoodies and he wants some sweatpants. So I'm going to go and get him a couple things, even though I got him some stuff for Christmas, but I'm gonna get her some like, get her, get him some like cheaper brands or like, cause I got him Under Armour for Christmas. So I'm gonna see if I can find some stuff at like Ross or something like that uh, so that he'll have a few extra pieces. And um, I wanted to go to Costco today, but I don't know if I'll make it out to Costco because I really don't want to go to that area because it is crazy. <laughs> but we are gonna go in. Ellie's lip is pretty bruised. I went ahead and canceled her appointment for Monday. I think that it'll be better if we just give her oh, some time God. off from it. It's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Is this a toy in it? Oh. No, it's just dress up. Yeah. Oh. Alright, so thanks to all my Dunkin' Donuts, or no, Starbucks trips in Disney, I managed to get a free peppermint mocha, which is pretty cool. And I got a chocolate thing. Oh yeah, Ellie got a thing. So I got one outfit for Trevor at um, Marshall's, which was a Jordan's outfit. Which wasn't the cheapest. I mean, it comes out to be almost forty dollars. And then I got my first Ray Dunphy. In all honesty, I picked it up for my friend Jillian, and if she doesn't want it, I'll keep it. But it says Mary. They did have a cup there, but it had like a stain on it. It said honey, but what if? And then I grabbed actually some stuff for Disney, like for the road trip and stuff, which is exciting. And then I found these. I don't remember if I vlogged it last night about looking for elf stuff, but I found these and these to go with the elf um, thing that the kids are doing. So yeah. So now we are going to head to Kohl's and see if I can find an outfit for Trev there. Um, I just want to look because I do have a 30% off coupon at home. I know for a fact and if I don't have it here I don't really want to go in there because, I mean, 30% is 30%. So we may just head home and we'll do Kohl's a different day when Trev is either with me or whatever. Do you want to just go home and then we'll come to Kohl's later? Yeah? Okay. So she's having that and I got her a Lunchable. Um, and I just got to find my keys. Did I put them in my ignition? Keys and my phone. Mommy's losing her mind. <clears throat> Alright, we're back home on our errands. And I was doing the 10 off 50 thing. And I got this for Casey and I got some things I'll show you in a minute for the Disney trip. Um, but this is $19.99 and I have these things. So I got him a couple more of these because he's really into Hot Wheels. And it's better than me giving him another lego set so i was really happy to get this for him and i think that he'll really like it because i guess you can like change to do different stunts and stuff so we're gonna wrap that up for him um i needed to get to 50 so i figured if i'm gonna get something for free i might as well get something we'll use so i got these for trevor normally he gets the ones that are four dollars and 19 cents because they don't have the coin so i got this one because it's four dollars and 99 cents and if he doesn't like it we can just exchange it for one he does like and then yesterday I got this order in the mail uh, of some Under Armour. So Under Armour sent me a 40 off 100 code and I made sure to get all this stuff on clearance. So all this stuff cost me $60, which if you shop Under Armour, you know how expensive it is. So these pants are normally $34.99 and I went ahead and got him those. Mommy. I fear these might be a little bit too small. If they are, I will try to exchange them, but they're like camo. They have Under Armour. But again, if these are too small, I will exchange them. Oh. These were a, one second, baby. These were the youth, oh wait, no, these were the youth small. But I think this is what his size said it was. I don't know. They look like they're like just going to fit him. So got him that. And then we got him this hoodie that is green and, or it's like a 
it's like a yellowy green blue color that's under armor and it's that like wicking material and this one is normally 50 bucks so I got that for him and he has an Under Armour hoodie but he cut it that I got him last Christmas so he'll have this one he'll have the other one I wrapped so that's good and then we got him these pants and these are a medium or a large yeah these are the medium which these ones almost look too big so he's like weird in between sizes right now but these are orange and they have the Under Armour there and then these were regularly $29.99 and then I got this shirt that matches the hoodie and matches one of the pants and it's camo and yellow and this one is normally $19.99 so I'm gonna wrap all this stuff up for the kids can you hand me that bag Ellie <clears throat> I also bought him all the clothes up there and we have I have all the stuff for the kids so I can make their elf costumes next time I get the one I, I, I hope I get Poodle and Jasmine yeah, I think if you get Jasmine, Aubrey's going to fight you for it. I know. Well, I'm just saying, calm down. Okay. What did you put that on your nose? Um, I didn't come over really walking through. There was a little... Uh, Antlers are dying. Mess. There's Mouth something cannon. wrong with your head. What? There's something wrong with your head. Am I allowed to say her name? No. Okay. Well, Miss Third Grade Teacher... She, she was in the hall and she was pinching on kids' nose, and I said, "Ooh, I want it!" And then she pinched my nose. What if you were allergic? I'm not. All right, Casey. This is. Has Ellie? Has Ellie on the elf? All right. This is your elf thing. So these are gonna be your socks. For elf day. You have a green hat. You have these <laughs> overalls. Suspenders. <laughs> And then a green shirt. And then you'll have to wear some kind of like sweatpants, tight pants. On my Fort Elton? Yeah. So go put that Do up I have on your room. Am I cool? You have the same thing. Your socks are a little bit taller and your things are like this. Can I wear them right now? No. What am I suspect? So go find pants, Robert, both of you. What do I do for this? You put them on your shirt and like these clip to the front of your shirt. And there's one in the back that clips. And so you'll have like lines going up your shirt. <clears throat> lines going up your shirt and around your back. Uh, do you have anything to my Where does now? this one go? It goes around your back. My on. I'll help you in the morning when it comes time to put them I on. I want to go out on Horrible Holiday to get stuff for that. Good morning, everybody. Today is Tuesday before break. The kids are um, having their last day of school. Trevor doesn't really have anything because he's in middle school, so it's like, you know, whatever. But uh, Casey and Aubrey are having parties. Aubrey's is in the morning and Casey's is in the, in the afternoon, so I'll have to go to the school twice. But they allow you to bring siblings here, which is cool because in New England, you can't. You're not allowed to bring any sibling, siblings into the school at all. And then, like, here, it's just, like, Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. You can say Christmas. You can say Merry Christmas. Like, it's insane. Like, in New Hampshire, it had to be holiday parties because... They didn't want to offend anybody and look i get that that like everyone doesn't celebrate christmas or whatever but here especially i think the majority celebrates christmas and by all means if i say some like merry christmas to someone and they wanted to say happy hanukkah back to me i'm not going to be offended like that's what you celebrate that's what i celebrate so it's kind of cool seeing like just how big they'll talk about christmas We are back home and I watched some budgeting videos. If you want a good channel that is Dave Ramsey type channel, check out Pennies and the Pearls. I'll try to remember to link her down below, but um, she and she has no idea I even exist. But I really like her channel. Um, and we said from day one, once we sold our house, 2016, the end of 2016, we were gonna be, you know, we were gonna get our house furnished and. Um, stock up on all the things that we have gotten rid of or we were out of or for so many years we just said oh we're not going to buy it because we don't want money so now that we have a good like foundation of everything we need here and you know we've gotten everything back up to where we want to be uh we definitely want to go like hardcore Dave Ramsey again and not on the fact of debt because we're debt free um but like super 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 um saving for like even more money to put down on a house um or just to like be able to do the projects we want to do to the house and pay cash for them um 
to be able to have a lot of fun this summer and go to different places this summer to um you know not have to stress about holidays and all that stuff like in the years past i don't i wouldn't say that we were stressed about the holidays but like it's been so nice this year just to know that everything is done um and you know like keep living like in your bills we like to have our bills like a month ahead so like you know we set aside and th these are just pretend numbers like we put aside two hundred dollars from each paycheck into like our bill fund uh so for us we always have eight hundred dollars in there and then we're putting in 200 so that we can just have our bills auto withdrawn or we know that we can just pay it and we don't have to worry about it you know what i mean so um yeah so we, we definitely want to be like real hard core dave ramsey this year like i gotta get better at staying at a target and um having a little bit more self-control uh and stuff like that and i mean i live on a budget like i don't i mean i do go over my budget sometimes but then i make up for it but just like maybe setting like a lower budget and you know what i mean and and really deciding do i really want this or do i really need this and all that stuff but i just filmed like a 2016 video so you guys will hear all my goals anyways but I thought I would show you guys these deals that we get. So some of these things we are going to use, like I said, for Easter, for whatever. So a bunch of these things I actually just got the other day and I'm going to bring them to Disney with us. And when Ellie wants something, I'll be like, do you want this instead? Um, because then it'll save her a lot of money. So let me flip you guys around and show you. This doll here, and I saw these dolls. These are $20, $19.99 right now in Target. This one we paid yeah we paid eight dollars and six cents for her so ellie loves dollies and stuff like that and i was thinking every day just give her one and then she can feel like she bought it or like i'll go into a store and i'll ask for a bag and bring it and give it to her and then it's saving her money because i'm only going to put 25 dollars on her gift card i know she's getting money from family so she's going to actually have 75 dollars and then give her this stuff and then maybe she won't even spend her money so that was a cool buy for sure the next two things so i'm gonna save this for easter because it has bunnies on it but it's the sky and bunnies and she loves sky from paw patrol but this one was four dollars and six cents and right now these are 11.99 so i think these are actually 12.99 at target so yeah and then this thing which i didn't realize was this big but she loves these twosies things um, and it's like a little play set and this is good because I have a feeling she's going to still be into this stuff come her birthday or whatever. Um, or I can give it to her for Christmas. I'm just waiting for everything to come in and see what I want because I do need to get her like one or more things. But um, yeah, so this set was $7.99. And this one is normally, well now it's not going to tell you. But I bet you it's a lot more on like Target. I'll try to look up on Target and leave like a little thing down below for that one. So there's those two. All right, and now there's this thing. So I had bought this thing from Kohl's. And it was regularly like $40 at Kohl's, but it had like a little figure with it. And I did get a sale on it. Like I think I got it for like maybe $20, $25, something like that. And then I did have a coupon. So it wasn't like an awful price. But... um I saw this one and I was like, okay, yeah, I definitely have to grab that. Okay, so this one I paid $7.99 for. This one is now on Amazon right now, $19.99. So it's like, yeah, and this is actually going to be a Christmas present of hers because she loves, she kept saying she wanted a gumball machine. And I think this is what she means because she doesn't chew gum. So, and it, like she loves Shopkins and she loves like these little sets where she can like put them up all on the shelves and stuff like that. So I think she'll love this. Now I have this huge box of presents. So I paid $3.90 for this. This is actually going to be a homeschool thing we're going to do. It helps her with her numbers and counting and stuff. And she loves Play-Doh. So I grabbed this as a new fun homeschool thing for us. And like I said, that one was $3.90. And right now on Amazon, it's $12.99. And then Trevor wants like all these modulus pieces so then trevor has all these guns that he wants for christmas and he asked for the modulus and he asked for the tri-strike 
And I want to say there was one other one. So I found this one. This one is the Modulus Ion Fire. And we paid $5.77. And this one is $14.99 in the stores right now. And I guess the cool thing with this gun is like all the parts are interchangeable. So this is going to be part of his birthday present. He's getting a huge gift from us. And then he's going to get... Um, my brother gave him a couple books. He's going to get this from us and one video game and then his big present. And then what else is in here? Okay, so these, if you can obviously tell, these are huge packs of um, ammo. So these packs of ammo were $7.67 a piece. And right now they're 20 bucks. So got uh, two of these. One will probably go to Trevor for uh, his birthday and one for Christmas. I may end up just giving them both for Christmas. And then the next two, the next two things here, they are guns, but they're in that fresh frustration free packaging, which if you can get that, get it because it's a lifesaver. Um, so we got these two guns and one of these is for Casey and one of them is for Trevor. Okay, so one of these is the Nerf in Strike Elite Dual Strike Blaster. I think that's that one. And that one has a original price of, or I paid $7.11 for it and it was $19.99. And then this one is the um, Nerf Strike, come on focus, the Nerf Zombie Strike Double Strike Blaster. I'm hoping this is going to be good enough for Casey, but this one is like 10 bucks in the stores. I know that I see it there often and it's $5.99. So it's like, you can't beat that with a stick at all. And then, oh yeah. And then this is the game that I picked up for Trevor. And this is like a $30 game, I want to say. Um, I'm pretty sure I've seen it at Target for 30 bucks. I paid $9.99 for this game and right now on Amazon. It's $17.94 and it's $19.99 apparently. I want to say it's $30 at Target, but often Amazon has pretty kick butt prices anyway. So this is going to be for Trevor for his birthday. This, um, you know, he'll get some Nerf guns and stuff. So I'm very happy with that. I'm very, very happy. And now I have some stuff in my gift closet. I was able to kind of beef up the kids Christmas. Um, I know people don't agree and that's fine. That's the beauty of the world that we live in is everyone can have their own opinion. Um, but you know, I did go over my something they want, read, whatever, but I feel like I did get them a good mix of toys, clothing, books, um, electronic stuff, uh, stimulating type stuff for their brains. Uh, so I'm really happy with it. I'm really happy with how we did things, but I'm going to try to get some stuff wrapped because nosy Nelly sitting here. If you see me wrap your Christmas presents, then I can't give them to you. I can't. Huh? I can't. You can what? I, I can't see Trevor's presents. No, you can't see your presents because then I can't give them to you. I, I can just see Casey's hat and clothes. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to try to put this stuff away. And, uh,. Yeah, and set aside a box for Trevor's birthday because I know that my mom and my aunt shut the door. are sending in presents for him. But like my brother left these two books. So if you don't know, my brother is a, um, he, right now he's in, just want to make sure our address wasn't on that box. Right now he is actually in grad school um, and he's actually getting to teach as part of his grad school experience. Um, he is a history major, and he uh, focuses on uh, LG, lesbian, gay, LGTB. I might be mixing up those words, but les lesbians, gay, bisexual, transgender, um, history, as well as black history, um, really focusing on um, women in um, black history. Uh, it's, he's actually uh, in school right now, and he's actually that's what he's going to teach. He's going to he's going to school to be a professor essentially. Um, he's very very passionate about it. So he got Trevor one of these books um, about like the different 
um, this time in history and Trevor loved it. It's really cool actually. It's a comic book, I'm pulling my own hair. It's like a comic book style book, but it's um, filled with like history, but you know, in those times especially, I mean, thankfully, I shouldn't say thankfully, but I am, I know I have it easy being a white female. And um, to teach a young child in a way that you can teach them the truth about what happened, as well as give the positives that have come, because there are some positives, you know, I mean, I know right now in the country, um, with everything going on, it's hard, and I'm, I'm trying to, to say this the nicest way possible, but, you know, there are definitely, it is better times than it was back then. I know right now for certain um, people of color, it still isn't any easier. One second, baby. Um, but anyways, long story short, my brother got him these books, so these are going to be part of his Christmas present, or his birthday present, and then I'll get him some stuff, so I'm just going to start putting aside all the stuff that I get for him um, because he really did enjoy the first book that my brother gave him as his Christmas present so I think that he'll really like these books. which I think is a little bit rare for fourth graders. And then I left and came home for a little bit and, you know, did the presents and stuff. And then I went to Casey's party. His party was so much fun. His, his teacher is like a Pinterest mom and um, she just like made these like little reindeer out of like, uh, like cake, cakes and candy canes and all kinds of stuff. And then um, they got to fill stockings, so everyone sent in stuff to make stockings, which, um, you know, like all the parents did, and then she did a little bit too. And then they made these, like, cards. It was just such a good time, and the kids had so much fun. And I love seeing Casey in the classroom and just participating and just meshing so well with the kids. All right, I'm back home, and I think these are my last few orders, and I have, like, a couple more things coming in. This is another thing that came in going to be perfect for Casey's Easter basket. This was $7.50 from $14.99. And Trevor and I were looking at this the other day for him. But didn't get excited when it was on $14.99 on it. And this was around $7. Maybe $8. And right now you can get this. And I think it has a doll on it. For like $20 to $30. Bucks. And I got it for, it was either $5.60 or $7.60. Um, again from the Amazon sale. This box there are some happy places. These were like three or four bucks a piece. And these are the things Ellie loves. Ellie said, I really just wish I could ask Santa for um, a big box of happy places. <laughs> she loves happy places so much. So um, I may give these to Santa. And then we got all these dolls that we will um, give, you know, maybe bring a couple maybe to Disney. And then save a couple and these were all and they were between five to seven dollars and these are all 20 bucks in target right now and the way it works is you take the water wand and you draw on their outfit and you can see basically their story so see how it does that so uh, we got cinderella merida and like i got merida because this is a princess aubrey would love so if aubrey sees this and she's like oh i want one then i'll give her one too Belle, of course. And these are the new princesses. And I'm not going to lie. I don't like the Hasbro ones. And then Tangled or Rapunzel. Who, however you want to say it. And then we also got him, um, Casey this shield. And it shoots off. Or it's magnetic or something like that. Yeah, it's a magnetic one. 
a shield and I forget how much this was but it was like five to six dollars I try to make sure I only buy things when they're 70% off um so yeah so I'm gonna put all these princess dolls with the Disney stuff I have I have a giant bag over here in my room I have this huge bag in that box I'm gonna put all that stuff in this box and I'll bring it downstairs Okay. 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 Playing, I don't think I could be funked up, but probably. Is this a safe to do? <laughs> Mommy, 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 where is it? What was the first one you need, Casey? Mommy, where is it? What was the first date we were behind on? Mommy, where is it? We don't know. We're just, we're just trying to. Two, one, find two, one. Where's Jordan? I can't, I can't find it. Silver. I see it. It's near Olaf. This. Two and a one. Twenty. Twenty one. Twenty. I see number one. Two. Oh, right here. Nineteen. Wait, where is it? Let's do it. Yay. We talked it. Oh, I did Then you guys didn't do yesterday because I was gone. We're going all the way up to 17. Oh, mommy, look at this guy. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, now find a 2 and a 0. I was looking for 17 and 16. And then 18 right next to it. Yes. Wait, let me see it. Near Anna and Elsa. Uh, oh, right here. Oh, a 2 nope. and a 0. Mommy, we're only up to 18. So we get four chocolates. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I got. Wait, can I show them what I got, mommy? I got SpongeBob. Um, another one. Um, two of these guys. I got Thor, Iron Man, Iron Man, and. No, I was seeing which chocolate to got. Go tell Trev to get his somebody. He's playing Xbox. Let me, I'm going to help you. I'm going to start I it. I got it. Clearly you do. <laughs> We're only one fell out. Which one was this one? Mm. Well, that was 19. That was the next one. So. Oh, yeah? You can have that one, Ellie. And we need 20. That's 18. Mm -hmm. And I need Here's 20. Here's on top of the fridge still. No, I... You guys are like all up his. in my bubble. Oh, look at 12s. Mommy, we need 12s open. No, Ellie probably just missed that one. 